Are you having problems with Internet Explorer? Does it frequently freeze, crash, or display error messages? Does it take too long for web pages to load? This video provides troubleshooting steps for resolving common types of Internet Explorer 10 issues. If the web page you are trying to view doesn't load correctly or has errors, make sure the site is compatible with Internet Explorer 10. If you are using the Start Screen Internet Explorer app to view a website, switch to Desktop View. Click the Page Tools icon and select View on the Desktop. If the website is still not working properly, there might be a compatibility problem between Internet Explorer and the website. To make the website always open in Compatibility View, open the Page menu and select Compatibility View Settings. Click Add and Close. If the problem is still not resolved, try resetting the Internet Explorer settings. Resetting Internet Explorer deletes all add-ons and customizations, allowing you to start with a fresh version of the browser. To perform a reset, press the Windows plus W keys. Then type Internet Options into the search field and select Internet Options from the results. Open the Advanced tab and click the Reset button. If you want to reset your home pages and search providers and to delete personal files, such as history and cookies, select Delete Personal Settings, then click Reset. After a reset, you might need to re-enter your personal information in trusted web pages. If the problem is still not resolved, try resetting the IP settings. Browsers use Internet Protocol to connect to the Internet. In some cases, the IP settings can be corrupted and need to be reset. To reset the IP settings, move the mouse pointer to the lower left corner, right-click, and select Command Prompt Admin. At the Command Prompt, type NETSH space int space ip space reset. Then press the Enter key. This command returns a series of resetting messages, followed by a Restart the computer to complete this action message. At the command prompt, type netsh space winsock space R-E-S-E-T. Then press the Enter key. After the command has run successfully, you must restart the computer to finalize the IP reset. Click Settings, Power, and then Restart. If the issue is still not resolved, open Internet Explorer without add-ons. Over time, browser add-ons accumulate and can produce spyware problems, error messages, or Internet Explorer startup problems. To open Internet Explorer without add-ons, move the mouse pointer to the lower left corner, right-click, and select Run from the menu. In the Run box, type I-E-X-P-L-O-R-E -E space hyphen E-X-T-O-F-F -F, and click OK. Internet Explorer opens without add-ons. If Internet Explorer is still not working properly, you might try some of these additional solutions. Try deleting your browsing history and cookies. Your browsing history or cookies may contain information that conflicts with the website you are viewing. Try changing advanced Internet options. This feature allows you to change the way websites are displayed. Try uninstalling an Internet Explorer update. 
Did the problem begin after Internet Explorer was updated? Uninstalling the update may solve the problem. To find solutions for specific problems and errors, check the HP Support website at hp.com support. Thank you for viewing this video. For more help, go to hp.com support.